Hola, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me and welcome back to a brand new video. I'm Kirsty Lowe and in today's video I'm going to be showing you the best setting powders that are perfect for oily skin. And these are my top five makeup setting powders that's going to keep your makeup looking matte and flawless all day long. But before we get into it, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. And without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Alrighty then, so let's start it off with this Laura Mercier translucent loose setting powder and it's the ultra blur version so this is the latest and newest setting powder that Laura Mercier has recently launched and this is just like the original version but this is now talc free and it's also got ultra blurring power and it's got a new infusion of ultra blurry ingredients including amino acid and silica powders to give you that super blurred soft matte finish it's very finely milled it feels weightless and breathable makes your skin look airbrushed and so filtered it's like as if you've got an instagram filter on your skin it doesn't settle into fine lines and it's not cakey so there's no cake face here it's got total shine control from day to night and it's also non-comedogenic so it's not gonna clog your pores that's why it's so good for oily skin and not only that it's fragrance free so it's suitable for oily sensitive skin as well so if you love the original version of this powder you're gonna love of this ultra blur version even more because this is even better than the original that's how good it is and it's got ultra blurring power i love it and onto the next setting powder i've got this fenty beauty invisi matte instant setting and blotting powder now if you watched the recent super bowl then you'd know that rihanna used this setting powder mid performance just to take away any shine and all that she's got on her skin and that's probably the best pr and advertising that she could have ever done for fenty beauty that's how much she believes in this product that she uses it mid performance during super bowl and i mean I don't blame her because I just love this powder so much. It blurs the look of pores. It makes my makeup last all day and it just controls oil so well. It's got a natural matte finish and there's no flashback and there's no cakiness. And it has got chia seed extract just to help to mattify and control shine. Look at the packaging of this, absolutely love it. It's got a mirror compact with a applicator sponge, all branded. And look at that. So this is actually refillable. You just top it up once it hits the pan. And this is a talc-free vegan formula. And to point out, Fenty Beauty is 100% cruelty-free. So just thought I'd point that bit out. So yeah, pop this in your handbag and you're good to go. And on to the next one, I've got this Revlon Colorstay Blot Matte Setting Powder. Now this is described as a setting powder with blotting power. And that's exactly what it does. It controls shine, absorbs any excess oil, and it reduces the appearance of pores. It just instantly makes your pores look so much smaller. And it mattifies your makeup for flawless finish. It's a silky soft formula and it doesn't leave a chalky film on your skin. And there's no photo flashback. And this is the interesting bit, the ingredients that's in this powder includes, let me just check my notes, it's a superfood detox blend of citrus, aloe, and check this one out, broccoli. Yeah, you heard right, broccoli. I don't think I've ever heard of a setting powder that's got broccoli in there. That's gonna help protect your skin from any pollutants. Yeah, broccoli in this setting powder. Okay, so onto the next one, I've got this Rimmel Stay Matte Setting Powder. This is like an oldie butter goodie and it's like a classic when it comes to setting powders. And it only retails for £4.50. £4.50, that's like an absolute bargain. So this is a really lightweight setting powder and it helps to mattify your skin and control shine. It sets your makeup into place and it's got like this really beautiful soft focus finish. It reduces the appearance of pores. So it gives you that flawless, beautiful looking skin. It does claim to have up to nine hours of matte finish. However, with this powder, I usually probably get about three, four hours of wear before I have to like reapply during the day to get that mattifying finish. For the price of this £4.50, I'm not really gonna complain because it does work, but you just need to reapply it throughout the day to keep that mattifying effect on your skin. This is like a makeup bag must have for oily skin. There's nothing fancy about it. It's like just a compact powder with no mirror. There's no sponge, it's just a compact powder so you might have to bring your own applicator or sponge with you if you're going to pop it in your handbag but £4.50 go buy this now 
Now last but definitely not least, I've got this One Size Ultimate Blurring Setting Powder. Now I love this setting powder, it's absolutely incredible. It's a really super fine setting powder with a soft matte finish. It's weightless, it's very smoothing and it blurs pores, blurs fine lines, it improves the look of textured skin. It controls my oils day and night and it makes my makeup last up to 14 hours. I love how flawless and long lasting this setting setting powder is and you'll be photo ready there's no photo flashback and there's no wipe casts and I just wanted to mention the size of this setting powder it is 34.5 grams which if I compare it to the Laura Mercier one the Laura Mercier one's got 20 grams this one 34 and a half grams that's how super sized this one is it's almost double comparing it to the Laura Mercier one but yeah, this is definitely one of the best setting powders for oily skin and I absolutely love it. So I hope you all found this video helpful. I mean, which setting powder was your favourite? And if you've got any recommendations for me or if there's any other products that you recommend for my oily skin, I'd love to know. So please comment down below. And if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel for post new videos every week. And I hope you all have an amazing day and I'll see you next time with a brand new video. Mwah. Bye guys!